Hey, what's up everybody? Here's another water comparison video. Tonight I'm comparing these two waters. First up is Crystal Geyser Sparkling Spring Water with Lime. Next up is Market Essentials Purified Drinking Water. So what these two have in common is these are both waters that I bought when I was on my trip to San Francisco. This Market Essentials Water is from the store Lucky Grocery Store. This Crystal Geyser Water is just from a random like gas station in France in San Francisco and the deal with the uh, crystal geyser is I've already reviewed the still version and now I'm just doing the sparkling one but this is like super popular in San Francisco apparently because every single store I went to had this and like you know small convenience stores this is like their main water I was kind of expecting San Francisco to have a lot of Arrowhead water because that's their Nestle regional brand but no, this was like the main one, Crystal Geyser. The still and the sparkling version was just like in every store, basically, that I went to. And so I really don't have a whole lot to say about these. So I'm just going to open them up and start drinking them and, um, you know, do a taste test comparison. The Market Essentials one is just like a cheapo brand. This was only 50 cents from Lucky Grocery Store. That's kind of, you know, expensive per bottle if you had bought in a whole case. But for a single bottle, 50 cents is, you know, it's a fair price, I guess. I don't think this is a Nestle brand or a Niagara brand of water. But that's what it tastes like. I think it's just because of the, um, you know, the material they use. It's like a thin plastic. I think that just causes the taste. And it's just standard reverse osmosis for the filtering. And this is distributed by... Save Mart Supermarkets, and I guess they're connected to Lucky Grocery Store somehow. And that's that's that. Now let's try Crystal Geyser. Hopefully, it does not explode. Good. Bubbled up a tiny, tiny bit. I'm glad it didn't explode like a volcano. Yeah, there's a good amount of carbonation in this. But I should note that I took this on a plane across, across the country and it's been sitting out for like a month on my shelf. So I don't know if that affects the, the carbonation in the water at all, but it's worth noting. Um, so maybe it would have exploded more if it hadn't had the change in, in altitude. The lime flavor is very, very mild. You can smell it a little bit, but it's not like strong. It's not a strong smell at all. Uh, Crystal Geyser was founded in 1977, so they're celebrating 40 years right now. It says, zero calories but this does have five milligrams of sodium which is bad and this was a dollar and 59 cents from the gas station i bought this at which might be higher you know generally you pay higher at a gas station for drinks than you do at like a grocery store they also have other flavors they have the sparkling water with lemon and with orange and with berry and I think they have some other flavors also So, I should let you guys know that, you know, I am biased. I prefer still waters over sparkling waters. So, and this comparison really just comes down to my own personal opinion. And in my opinion, I think the Market Essentials water is better. So, Market Essentials is moving on to the next round. I'm going to burp. <laughs> Excuse me. There's a lot of carbonation in there. Builds up and I hate to burp. Uh, so, yeah, so Market Essentials is the winner. Let's move on to the next round. 
So congratulations. I've been I'm gonna be doing a lot of reviews in the next couple of days, I think. Cause I've got all these waters building up over here. And I wanna get rid of them. I wanna drink them. So they don't take up space in my room. Um, thanks for watching everyone. Bye.